Principles of Classification From the 19th edition of the UN Model Regulations, to help resolve conflicts between GHS classifications and transport classifications, a clarification is introduced to ADR Chapter 2.1. The new entry confirms it is a guiding principle of the regulations that substances listed by name in the dangerous goods list shall be carried according to that entry. Where a consigner has new test data which indicates that a listed substance has additional hazards not identified in the list, it may be transported with competent authority approval, either under the listed entry but with additional hazard communication information, or under the most appropriate collective entry. We see this as a clear indication to confirm that for transport purposes, it is the classification principles of the transport regulations that must be observed. This will be particularly important for those substances listed in Table 3.1 of CLP with classifications that do not correspond with their UN entries, such as dichloromethane and propionic acid mixtures. It should be noted that many entries in the UN Dangerous Goods list also take into account human experience in their classification, such as methanol and iodine. They may therefore not correspond to a GHS mixture classification or a CLP harmonised entry.